Welcome to the Dentamax appointment book or scheduler. To access the scheduler, it's very easy to do. All you have to do is click on scheduler here at the top of your screen. This little link is always there, so it's always easy to access your scheduler. Uh, Dentamax um, has the most powerful but yet easiest to use scheduler on the market. I know that's a bold statement, but let me show you what I mean. Um, from your appointment book or your scheduler, um, you can look at different views. So here I am looking at my three operatories. If your hygienist wants to view maybe the hygiene appointments by themselves, we can go ahead and select that view instead. Not only can you view different views for your providers, but you can look at a day at a glance, week at a glance, and month at a glance. And within any of these views, if you want, you can go ahead and right click and send an email reminder to those patients in that view. So if we click on send email reminders for this view, we're sending an email reminder to David and to Donald. Let me go ahead and take us back to our regular view that we were looking at. You can see here that it's 2 o'clock Arizona time. The current time is outlined in red on both sides of the appointment book. Um, it's easy to move your appointments around. All you have to do is click on the appointment and you can move it to another operatory. Another thing that's easy to do from within Dendamax's appointment book is moving appointments from one day to another. To do that, just right click on the appointment and select Add to Clipboard. And Dendamax will place the appointment, or if you want, multiple appointments onto your clipboard up here in the upper left hand corner of your screen. Then you can go to a different day if you choose and move your appointment to another day or just to a different time slot on the existing day. You will note, not until I move the appointment does it take away the old time slot. If you're in a busy office and you pinboard an appointment, it might be pretty important if you don't find a new time slot to keep that spot for the old appointment. Let's go ahead and move James Davis back. From here we can make our appointments longer or make them shorter. Now we don't want to go over our lunch and you can have templating so if you have a late start day or a lunch that you want to keep track of or place your appointments uh, in different, different parts of the day. For example, here we have a high production area for our afternoon. We'll schedule our root canals or our crowns or bridge work. Um, from your appointments, you can right click on any of them and go to any other part of the program for that patient. For example, here we are looking at David Arnett's appointment. If I want to jump over to his chart, all I have to do is right click on the appointment and select view chart. It will take me right to David's chart. In the upper left-hand corner of our screen, we have our backward and forward button. So just simply by clicking on the back button, it takes us right back to David's appointment. Um, I can also right-click on his appointment and check for his eligibility status. And so instead of having to call each insurance company to get the breakdown of benefits or just to make sure that they have current eligibility with their insurance, just a simple right-click and uh, click on Check Eligibility, and you'll know if they have insurance or not and what the breakdown of the benefits is. Huge, tremendous time saver. Um, another neat thing is we can go into View Scheduled Revenue. From this screen, we can see the money that we have scheduled to happen by doctor, by day. Not only can we see scheduled production, we can see actual completed work with the dollars that represents by day and by provider, and actual cash flow, posted payments by provider for each day of the month. Wonderful feature there. You can also print um, Dymo labels from your appointment. So if you have a new patient where you need to, need to print out a Dymo label, you can go ahead and do that and place it on their chart. You can also print out routing slips. If you're using routing slips, just go ahead and click on Print Patient Report and select the routing slip to print out a routing slip for that patient. And then you can go ahead and, and clip it to your, your patient's chart to hand to the provider. And maybe the last thing is that you can easily find open time slots from your appointment book. Just click on Find Open Time Slots. Maybe that patient can only be seen on Wednesday, so you can go ahead and limit your search scope to Wednesdays, and they have to see maybe a certain doctor, and only one operatory will do, so you can go ahead and pick the exact criteria that you'd like to select, and go ahead and search based on that criteria to find the perfect time slot for your patient. I hope you can see that the appointment book for Dentamax is very easy to use, very friendly, and yet very powerful.